No. All right, well, that's the end of that question. Oh, yeah, no. <laughs> but you have. What? You watch lesbian porn. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, it's recording. Oh, we look amazing. Hello, everybody. Yo, beautiful people, my name is Koi and welcome to my brand new show, The Safe Space. Now, The Safe Space only has two rules. Rule number one, whatever my guest does, I must do too. Rule number two, every guest has only one opportunity to say, change the conversation. The moment they say this, I must do just that with no questions asked. It's finally time for every opinion and experience to have a safe space, whether we like it or not. This is about to be the safest space on the internet. Are you ready? Welcome, welcome to, to The, the safe, safe Space. space. Yo, beautiful people. Now, guys, I have a special guest on my show. Now, when I found out I managed to finesse the thing and get this amazing guest on my show, I was excited for one reason, the clickbait. Porn, nugget porn, um, cheating, girls, all them things there. But, guys... Cheating? <laughs> wait, 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 wait. I got you, I got you, I got you, boy. I'm bringing it back, I'm bringing it back. But, guys, after doing tons of research, this person has so many layers to them, and cheating is not one of them. Yeah, I got you. Um, this person is a business person, a father, and also still savage himself. Guys, I have an amazing guest today, Savage Dan. How are you doing? I'm bro? good. Thank you for having me. <laughs> Thanks for correcting that little mess. I don't happened. even know what I've got myself into, you know, if bro, I'm totally honest. I feel like you can handle it, though. Of course I can. I feel like all my guests have come on not knowing what they're going to do, but it's going to be fun. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. There I mean, we go. There we go. You know what? There's so much I know about you, but let's just let's ease on in. Yeah? We're gonna start off with the. <laughs> I don't know. Like I'm already stressed. Don't be stressed. I'm already stressed. I listen. I'm with you in this. Do you remember? Whatever you do, I gotta do. Okay. So I'm with you in this. This okay. is the safe space. All right. We both get twanged today. Do you know what I mean? It's okay. Calm. So this is the assessment. It sounds a bit scary, but I'll break it down for you. We have a couple shots here. I have a quiz. This quiz is completely based on who you are. You know yourself, right? So every time you get a question right, you don't have to drink. Okay. Every time you get it wrong, you have to take a shot. I have to take a shot. Quickly. <laughs> okay. Like, <laughs> okay. Quickly. There we go, come, yeah, give it to me. What if, what if the information you have mm -hmm. is a lie that I've told? Nah, it's still dun, came dun, from you. Nah, sorry. So I'm saying, no. We're going to cut that out. Um, so <laughs> <laughs> listen, if it, if it matches what I saw online, then that's it. That's what you came right, cool. to the world. Perception. All right, you know cool. I mean? All right, then. Let's jump straight in. This is the assessment. First question. You are a big supporter of Chelsea. Yeah? Correct. <laughs> oh, it's okay. Yeah, You're yeah, a big supporter yeah. of Chelsea. You have them tattooed on your chest. Yeah. And you've even gone on record saying that if your son supported another team, he might have to find a new house. Would have to, yeah. Oh, okay. He's he's only four, right? Five. Five, okay. So he's old enough. He's a big man He's now. a big man. Yeah, yeah. He knows his decisions. <laughs> he knows his decisions. Okay. In a popular song written by Afro B, what is the name of the girl he accuses of playing him like Drogba? Georgia Smith. Georgia fucking Smith. I don't know. Oh, I don't know this song, man. Oh, my like... God. What's Who was going it? On here? Joanna. Jo, Jo, Joanna. So we, ha we have to take we a shot. We have to take a shot. So start getting these questions right, sir, yeah? All right, cool. All right then. Cheers. Cheers. Long life on that. Okay. There you go. <laughs> oh, this is embarrassing. I don't bro. love it, innit? I don't love it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, next question. Before being called Savage Dan, you were called Snowman Dan. Wow, how do you know Snowman Dan? Come on. And before That's that, you were called you. Biggie. Oof, yeah, yeah? Yeah. That's it. So, you should know this answer. Okay? How tall in meters is the biggest snowman in the Guinness Book of Records? Come on. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Biggie, Snowman, Savage <laughs> Dan, let's do You're it. You're asking me questions that, are, <laughs> like, this is, that was nothing to do with me. Why, are you, why were you called Snowman Dan? <laughs> <laughs> I'm calling the police. <laughs> I'm calling the police. <laughs> I'm calling the police. <laughs> that was scarier than the confession. I'm calling the police. That's 12 years right there. I'm going to go 50 metres. 50 metres? No, that was wrong. It was 38. I'm f That's not... How did they... How yeah. did they get 38 metres in the air? I don't know. I don't man. even know they, why I went They used 50. like a crane type of thing still. Take a shot. Oh, okay. Take a baby one. That, that, was, that was for me. Yeah, that's a baby one. That was designed for me to fail. No, it wasn't, man. What's all this? I've got you. Mm. All right. Last question of the assessment. You were one time going to a community sort of... Service? Yeah. <laughs> You're trying to make it sound classy. Community. She was trying to make it seem like it's a community centre. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> you change your brand and try to support the thing, do you know what I mean? My point is still it's, there. It's, it's, it's a part of you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a part of you. So, man went to community service yeah. and them things there. Enjoyable. I actually quite liked it, man. Big up Errol because, yeah. How many was... times did you go? What do you mean? Community service. Well, I went for months and months <laughs> and months. But you didn't have to go I went for like a year. Yeah. A year? Yeah. Oh, that's a I had a lot of hours, event. yeah. Oh, okay. Well, you learned your lesson. Yeah. And so look Indeed, at you now. Yeah, yeah. All right then. Whew, child. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> now, before you owned two studios, you used to have a screensaver. And this was of the Hit Factory. Yeah. What is the name of the rapper that was stabbed outside the Hit Factory? Biggie. No, Biggie wasn't stabbed outside I the Hit know. Factory. I don't know. Cameron? 50 Cent. Oh, is it? But I'm frassed, so I don't know. <laughs> do we need to take the shot? <laughs> <laughs> do we need to do it? Alright, let's take the let's shot. Take we have to, we shot, have to. We have to follow the rules. We have to follow the rules. Cheers. We're on the hit five three. Shout out fifty. All right. I feel like you did really badly, but I feel like I did even worse. So <laughs> that was the assessment. You feel good though, right? Yeah, yeah. It wasn't yeah, as bad as yeah, you thought no, it would be. Yeah. That was light. It was light, very light. And I feel like we learned so much about you. Yeah. All right then. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Guys, we're going to jump straight to the break and then when we come back, we're going to learn even more about Savage Dan. Yo, beautiful people, this is obviously not an ad, but this is an invitation. If you feel like you have a brand message or product that would connect with my audience, let me know at collabs at koelawow.com. That's collabs at koelawow.com. Alright, let's get back to the show. This segment is called The Box. So during quarantine, um, I came up with loads of questions that I thought were really interesting, no matter who I asked. So I just want to ask my guests these questions. Cool. We flow. And remember, whatever you do, I have to do. So you answer the question, I have to answer the question. Cool. So, what happens if I don't answer the question? Um, <laughs> Has anyone never done that? Is it, no? The people that you know I can fight. You know I can fight. I heard that you can yeah. fight still. <laughs> I heard. I heard you can fight, but I'm Nigerian. So I, I, no, I hear that. I'm from, yeah. Do you know what I mean? I hear you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, cool. Let's jump straight in. Ooh, child, we said hot. What would your ex say about you? I'm the wave. You're just the say wave. I'm the wave. Yeah, just say I'm the guy. Really? That's the guy. Yeah, just say I'm the guy. Oh, well, that was a. Quick what about answer. you? You gotta answer this. Yeah, what would my ex say about me? Um. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what? Can I say something, innit? Because this would have been an easier question to answer with the one beforehand, innit? Because he was he was bin liner. But the last one was actually all right. He was an all right, dude. I think. Um, I think he would say that. She's good. She's a nice egg. She's a good girl. Um, but where's the butt? but? Just bring the but, butt in. Do yeah. you know what? But she don't know what she wants. Oh no, that's all women. Fuck off, bro. What's going that's on? That's all women. That's not all women. Nah, that's, that's not all, all women. women. Nah, that's Actually, not you. Because do you know what it is? We should have just been friends. Okay. We should have just been friends. Who, who's but I decision? Let him, I let him press me. Do you know what I mean? Okay. I let him press me because. I like decisiveness, do you know what I mean? And, and he was, he's a nice yes, guy. Yes, yeah, 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 yeah. I like decisiveness, he's a nice guy. Um, but I was not ready for a relationship, man. I wasn't. I didn't do a madness. It sounds no, like yeah, I did yeah, a madness. Yeah, no, yeah. No, no. I didn't do a madness. Even I was thinking that. <laughs> no, no, no. I did not do a madness. No, we were both completely. Don't fuck up my market, bro. We were both completely like faithful to you, each other. You just grew from apart. what I answered. But like, we should have just been friends. So at one point, it's, it doesn't fulfill anymore, in it. And then you can get a little bit bitter towards each other um yeah which i think that's maybe what he did but he apologized and i appreciate you and i was difficult i probably at one point is it not I'm difficult the but like, i think i'm the most easy person to no, be in a relationship not. with well, no you're not i'm the no, easiest I, I know from watching vlogs about you you're not, not i'm vlogs, easy sorry. <laughs> i've seen <laughs> i've like, yeah, seen the vlogs i don't think she's seen the vlogs i don't think so i don't think so because you're the kind of person i feel like you make decisions and then the other person has to just kind of deal with it not even deal with it because i do i do compromise i do compromise mm -hmm. but i'm pretty i call bullshit pretty fast isn't it? like okay. as in like if i feel like nah that's not happening then it's not happening okay but and i'm impossible to argue with so yeah, people I can that, get that. yeah as I in like that. i like some people like to argue mm -hmm. if you're one of those people that for me, I'm a nightmare for you because you'll try and argue with me and I will just play FIFA. Oh, what I'll about, just play what about FIFA. Crying? Does crying work on you? Crying work on me? Yeah, nah. You, don't I, you know I laugh when people cry. Oh, okay, good night. Guys, that's the end of the I show. I can't help it. <laughs> <That's> it. <laughs> like, you laugh when people cry. I know, I do this weird, stupid smile thing, yeah, that it wants to be a laugh, but Have it's trying to not be. Have you ever been hit by a girl? Yeah, of course. 
My ex is violent. Why did you point at me? No, yeah, yeah, no, yeah. That's not my... I didn't do nothing like that. <laughs> I was... Co- Listen. But do you know what it is? The way I've got this head movement, like, it's, yeah, it, it's going to make it even angrier. Right. Stupid, stupid question, yeah? Does that then lead into, like, sexy time? Never. Really good. Oh, good. Nah. Stand up for your rights. Don't let it go. Do you know what it is? Usually I'm in, the, like, the 70th minute as well, and it's... Well, on FIFA? Online. She's if you care you. about your online record, yeah, I mean, you know you can't just stop I know because you you're in the middle of a domestic. You, you, just, you just twank her arms to the side in there. I, I just... move. Oh, oh, I do nothing. Like, I, there was once where this you come out and threw keys yeah. at my head and the TV's here and they were coming from here and I just dodged it and I, was, I just carried oh, on playing. Yeah. You must have... It's carried on playing. Crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's trying to yeah. twang you. She's trying to fuck yeah. up your game. And you're like, no, nope. brother. No. Nope. And I got another nope. one. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's it. You're I don't want to He said, what's going on? I'm like, nah, bro. I'm like, that's good. Like, that, that's... Mm-mm, not me. Yeah, I could never. I could ne- No. Okay, cool. <laughs> this episode. Whoa. Any fetishes? I'm, do you know why? Because these are the questions I wanted to come up and they're just coming up. Jesus. I'm loving it. Nah, just, do, just, do, just be nasty. That's it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Right, That's what I'm saying. I'm saying, dude, yeah. you see me? I'm someone, I'm not going to do this. All right, can I, I suggest we're doing it. Go on then. All right, so t- let me just... All right, cool. Go ahead, right, go, cool. go, 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 go. All right, spin them out. Mandatory. La- mandatory. Mandatory. Okay. All right, cool. Spanking. Mandatory. All right, okay. Choking with, with rope. <laughs> what? Who's got the rope? Who's got... Oh, Hold <laughs> on. Bro, that's called... Isn't that called lynching? Bro. <laughs> Who's got on? Can the cameras... Can the cameras do the experience? <laughs> no, alright, so... Alright. <laughs> He's a lynch. No, that's not funny. We can't laugh. We can't laugh. You're fucking up my brand. Yeah. Um, alright, cool. For me, personally... Um, I, like I said, I haven't discovered, but I'm definitely open if I have like the right partner to discover in my thing. Um, but I do have a story. Is that okay? Can I say my story? It would do. It depends on the story. Uh, wait, no, but just say you yeah. Know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so after I broke up with one dude back in the day, it was a very boring, very vanilla relationship. Like he was very like honestly, I think he's my least favorite ex. Yeah. Um, not 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 because of the vanilla-ness, because He just wasn't a very nice person. But then if you want to add vanilla-ness to it. Fucking hell, what were we yeah, doing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so then after that, yeah, um, I thought, do you know, fuck it. Imagine a young queer. Fuck it. I want to experience life. Um, and so then, I don't know how, yeah. yeah. Right, that's a bad start. Yeah, whenever you hear that. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know how, I don't know how we got here, yeah, but um, I met this dude. And this dude was on crud. Like, he was saying stuff I've never heard before, in it. We started off talking, yeah, and it was meant to get into sexy talk, but he was so far gone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That it became just a documentary while I listened <laughs> to him tell me about all the debauchery that my man was on, in it. Obviously, when it came down to go, on, when it came time to go on a date, I was not available. Because I wasn't on that kind yeah, of scared. Yeah, yeah, of course. He was yeah. on chimney shit. Yeah. I wasn't chimney. No, 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 I was smokeless. Yeah. <laughs> I, was, I wasn't on it. So, yeah, so that was my story. But I will say that as I've grown older, and I finally des- decided that sex is also for me, it's mad, it's a journey. Um, I'm open. But not to the pissing thing, though. Why are you pointing at me? No, I'm not judging you. you. Sorry. Oh, yeah. I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not judging you. I'm not judging you. <laughs> I'm not judging you. 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 Um, Pawns your thing. I saw that you were following. Um, that was a mad segue, innit? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Welcome to the same yeah. space. I saw that you were um, following. You said something about how you follow porn stars on, on socials. I oh, followed I a couple. Get... I had to unfollow. Okay, good. I had to, yeah, I unfollowed. Oh, I mean, that's calm. Yeah. That's calm. No, you know what it is? It's Kelsey Monroe. Okay. I followed her. But then obviously, you see, like, you watch stories and it's just. it's. I don't need that. I don't need to, I don't need to see it. This you know what I'm saying? Touch. So I had to unfollow. So you're yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I had to sometimes, unfollow. Yeah. Sometimes you just got to remove yourself from the situation. Do you know why it's good for... Do you know why I thought it was actually quite clever of me? Mm-hmm. Yeah? It was unclever in the end, but I thought it was clever because you see, like, mm-hmm. regardless of any of what anyone says, yeah. anyone can be caught out at any point and all of a sudden the person who was oh, so faithful mm-hmm. all of a sudden got caught in this mad web and they cheated by accident. They gave me caught neck of mm-hmm. a girl or whatever it was. Yeah, it was whatever something's it was. happened. You've, you've, you've made an accident. That's what happens when you follow Man, back. You did a boo-boo. That's it, you did a boo-boo. Yeah, but this is what happens when you follow back the pretty girl from 
flipping Enfield mm -hmm. that you can go there in 40 minutes or whatever it is. You mm -hmm. see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Stop following them and then they're laughing at you in your DMs. Mm -hmm. You yeah. haven't even done nothing funny, but ha, ha, ha. Do you see what I'm saying? Yeah, all of a sudden, yeah, yeah. you do the key, 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 yeah. and all of a sudden, Kelsey Monroe, it's not happening. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? Let me just follow Kelsey Monroe. It's not happening. It's safe but for me. But you've made a lot of amazing things happen in your life. I could make it happen. So uh, that's what I'm saying. I, could, I, I could really happen. feel like... <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Listen, I didn't believe in the Savage Dan thing for a second, innit? But this guy actually lives life like he's really one cop. Anything. Any... I feel... I feel... I'm... All right, cool. We're moving on. I don't feel it for myself personally, guys. Thank you very much. All right, let's move on. Ooh. Ooh, okay. Have you ever questioned your sexuality? No. All right, well, that's the end of that question. Oh, no. yeah, no. <laughs> but you have. What? You was lesbian porn. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I okay. I don't think you're allowed to do that to people, but <laughs> <laughs> I have questioned it though because I found the relationship I was in so not satisfying. So I thought maybe all dudes are not satisfying. But I think for me, I I still like dick. I, yeah, want, I, I hear that because you know what, what? I, mean? I thought it was going to come out in, no, a, no. in a kind of more no, articulate no, I still like it. no I still yeah, like yeah, both yeah, yeah, same yeah. space we do yeah, 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 you know yeah. what I mean I heard that um, um, I haven't got the Chelsea deals yet so yeah, I can, yeah, I can yeah, just yeah. spill yeah your yeah, 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 thing is still yours <laughs> my thing is still I don't want it to be my thing anymore sign me you know one of my boys once said yeah that all mandem should be allowed to go on a 7 day subscription to being gay and then what should happen here yeah, is that at the end of the seven days, if you if you don't like it, then you should be able to just because uh, you should just be able to just be sh like straight if you want. The to thing again. is, yeah. But the thing that you guys don't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, 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 Flirt between the two. I, I, I Maybe I've got this all wrong, but I thought that's what that was. Like, as in, that's when. No, I think bis bisexual is when you definitely like the two. So anyone who you're with could be a guy or a girl. You're good. I feel like that. I feel like a lot of girls fall into that category. I think it's because we're 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 allowed to. Like, no, obviously yeah. some girls are one hundred percent bisexual, but I think because no one questions it, no one, no one who. Do you know what I mean? Some people even say it's sexual. I reckon a lot of girls are bisexual, but. The, the way society is set up, mm -hmm. they just go and get the man and have the kids and do all of that. Oh, and do you just, think? Yeah, I think so. Yo, I don't know, there was a whole, there was a whole, um, I don't know if you watched Jay-Z's interview with Letterman where he comes out about his mum being a lesbian and he kind of just talks through. What? Jay-Z's mum's a lesbian? Jesus. Breaking news, yeah. That's yeah, mad, he, I had no yeah, idea. Yeah, he, he spoke about it on 444, I think. Yeah, yeah, so he spoke about it. And he said he always kind of knew. I would never And 50s, was it 50s as well? Growing up, I was confused by mama kissing a girl. Confusion, of course, growing up in the cold. I mean, Hold it's on, quite that's black and white. <laughs> Man, just, just singing the lyrics. That's yeah. it, yeah, yeah literally. Love that. Cool, last question. You ready? Yeah. Are you enjoying this? I am. I feel like you're enjoying this. I am, of course I am. I feel I'm. like you're enjoying this. I, I don't know, should I pick this one? Okay, it's the last one. Okay. Oh, what's the worst thing about dating you? Communication. I'm yeah. the worst communicator. But I'm the worst. Though, I feel like. I feel like you know how to communicate, you just choose not to. I am a, I am a, like, I can speak all the languages of love. <laughs> like, I can speak all of them. What is your language of love? What's your love language? Do you know? I like snuggles. That's not one of them, brother. Is touch, snuggles touch, not a love touch, language? Touch, yeah, 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 yeah. So I like, like, <laughs> get me, like, contact. Oh, okay. Get me, Disney or Harry Potter. Yeah, 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 I'm a, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's a human. No, 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 don't fall into this. Like, this was my thing. This is how it worked. <laughs> Like, honestly, it was mad. Like, I had a, like, um, I lived alone from young. Mm -hmm. So I learned how to play my home games. Okay. And I was playing them, you know what I mean, like, fixtures regular kind of thing, okay. innit? And I always had the, like, I had a sofa that was kind of like this. And the way I'd set up was so that my opponent your, was over. Your girlfriend? No, no girlfriend at the time. Okay. There was no girlfriend. But Are you call it an opponent? Yeah, like a girl. You're terrifying. But okay. <laughs> You're terrifying. You are horrible. Would sit there and I would start here. Mm -hmm. And obviously, you get me like when you when you come in, like it's the whole. It's not too soft, but it's not too. So it's like a young J J Cole. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's just an in between kind of music, kind of thing. Dim the lights a little bit, whatever. Just just make it comfortable. Do you know what I'm saying? Cool. But then obviously, over the 90 minutes, I've got to get from here to there. And to do it, you Perfect. usually need some kind of Disney, 
some kind of you see what I'm saying like some something that yeah that in, frozen that helps now nah, frozen wasn't even out them times right. like there was no Beauty and the Beast Cinderella Beauty and the Beast I hope sorry babes because yeah, yeah, of that yeah sorry babes but yeah Aladdin one of them ones yeah <laughs> <laughs> it is gonna be one of those that closes the gap uh, cool. basically and then all of a sudden you start moving you make her feel safe because and there's then, nothing immediately seductive it's like. not even, it's it's not even seduction it's just moments do you see what I'm saying like I'm a just set the scene and just create something and just let it happen it will happen and if it doesn't happen do you know what the best thing to do is just for guys do you know what the best thing to do is at a time where you're struggling to break that kind of contact barrier show some sauce and put your legs on her legs she'll ask you if you're comfortable you say yes and then you shimmy over you know I mean? like it's just it's, it's, it's routine wins routine victories you make me sick. <laughs> you make me absolutely This is the old me, the young me when I had legs. So isn't it hard to fall in love when everything is like a conquest? No. It, it, I, I fall in love so easy. Do you know why? Why? Disney. <laughs> the Disney's on the screen. So yeah. it can happen that night. We can you fall in love, love that night. night. Yeah, ten night. I don't think it's love, bro. It, it is. is. It is, it's it is love. real love. Yeah. Like, how many times have you fallen in love? How many times have you watched um, Aladdin... And listen to and watched a whole new world yeah. whilst like this with someone. Never. Do it. I just do it. Yeah, me, do <laughs> it. Said, let me help you fall in love. Hey, hey, hey. Do it. See what happens. Dan, you truly are a savage. Thank you so much. That has been the box. We don't have time for one more, do we? Nah, so that has been the box. You have been fabulous, but there's still more. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. So you guys watch the break and be right back after this. You're a creative, and you're looking for the perfect way to bring your ideas to life without spending a fortune on getting all the newest gear. If this sounds familiar, then Rent Equipment Now is for you. Yo, beautiful people, are you paying attention? This company is called Ren. Not only is it black-owned, but it's also female-owned. And without them, the safe space wouldn't have the quality of sound it has today. Guys, I was able to rent industry-standard audio equipment from these guys at a really affordable price. So, if the only thing standing between you and your vision is expensive equipment, let me help you out. Use my code, quote2021, Guys, I got a cold. <laughs> and um, get exactly what you need to make 2021 exactly what you want it to be. Um, but it's only for the first 50 people, so don't waste time. All right, let's jump straight back into the show. Yo, beautiful people, welcome back to The Safe Space. I'm still here with Savage Dan. We are jumping into a new segment called Shine Your Eyes. And that's when we watch something that I found particularly interesting. And then we just kind of talk about it. Okay. If you don't mind playing cameraman. <laughs> <laughs> I'm done for real now. No your button. Letting that shit breathe, huh? <laughs> this chick tweeted, men be like, wow, your energy is amazing, and then rob you of it. <laughs> <laughs> That's some funny shit, right? <laughs> That's some funny shit. Yeah, why do chicks let us rob them of their energy, <laughs> though? It's your like, energy. it's yours. <laughs> Protect it. Yeah. Stop falling for the hookah yeah. and the drink. Yeah. Keep, keep your left up. <laughs> <laughs> that mint coconut combo. That's what I wanted you to watch. All right, cool. Why did you pick that one when I'm on? Yeah, you listen. Why did you pick listen, that one when I'm on? I said, shine your eyes, in it. You have to open your eyes. you got to learn a couple of new things. I want to learn some stuff as well. In my head, I was raised on Disney. I was raised on this idea that everybody is looking for a partner and someone to love. Yeah. I'm now a big woman mm -hmm. and I'm very aware of that's not the case. Like people actually enjoy conquest <coughs> and competition and kind of getting one over on the other person and avoiding L's. And I kind of just wanted to speak to you about that a little bit. You know what it is? It's worse now. Remember, I haven't dated for seven years. Mate, it's Like horrible. being in the market now must be a madness because... I haven't been in it. I've, latched, I've kind of like... I, I'm very comfortable by myself, but then I'm like, yo, I need, you know, a regular comfortable penis, and I want a baby, and I want like obviously not right now, but I want I want those things in it. So at one point you've got to start putting yourself out there, yeah. and I just don't know how to do it because things I aren't things aren't what they seem out there now. That's the thing. So Honestly. I, I, like put it this way, like obviously when I was when I was playing football, is that, is that dating? Okay, dating cool. Yeah, when I was playing football, I was set up. 3-4-3, three, three, and I was always playing home matches. I lived alone from quite young. Okay. So I was always, always knew the stadium, I knew the fans. Okay. Like, it was, it was always going to be more likely than not a win okay. for me. 
which is good for me. For for people that don't fuck with football, basically, you should have got that anyway. He, he was very familiar. You, you always set up your dates in your zone. And yeah, in my house, and also <laughs> <laughs> that's my best. Really a date. That's... You just kind of finesse it, turn it into a date, put some Disney on. But what I'm saying is. It was... Have you called the police yet? Because <laughs> I've called them three times and they haven't come yet. Okay. <laughs> but what I'm saying is, the reason I was able to do it is probably because I think women are naive. Yeah. I think men are naive as well, to a certain degree now. But I would say women are naive because you grow up in this whole... Like, I've got a daughter now. My whole thing has changed. I watched a podcast where you said after you had your daughter, you didn't watch porn for three weeks. I couldn't even watch it. For three weeks. Yeah, three weeks. <laughs> He's like, I'm, I'm back, baby. I'm, I'm back, baby. She's big, she's grown. <laughs> she... But as in, having a daughter changed my entire perspective on So what was women. your perspective before? It was kind of... Before, it was kind of men versus women. It was Venus versus Mars. Okay, okay. can, can, can we jump into that really yeah. quickly? Because that's what I feel like. I feel like, it, like we want to be together for whatever reason, yeah. but it's genuinely uh, who's going to take the L and yes. who's going to take the W. Yes. See, I just want to be, I just want to love. I'm too comfortable. Like, I, I think I need to to, to to accept my level a bit more in it because I'm a sweet one and them things, they're gun fingers to the top there. <laughs> but like, I feel like I'm very comfortable like chilling. Yes. A lot of people are comfortable chilling. But here's but the thing, take advantage here's of the thing of chilling, there. yeah? Mm -hmm. Now, I, I feel like, correct me if I'm wrong, but I feel like females put a price on... The key. They almost put a price on, on, on it. Dick. Yeah, no, on what you're giving. You'll be like, right, well, if I'm going to do it, then he better take me here or whatever it is. There's certain, do you know what there's it, certain it, points he price. has to pass. It's not a price. I think it's a, if this goes wrong, I want to know that at least. I've got something. A date, anything. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, it's a price. It's a price. No, because, because the tears that you cry when you just chilled fucked that like, I know this that like, you just wait hold on this looks messy but like the, the price that you you're right. like the yeah, L that right. you take right. here when you you thought this was a real one and you didn't expect too much and you didn't require too much yes that those tears yeah are acidic do you know why so, like you need to like make sure that at least you not necessarily fuck it if, if the yeah. girl wants I could sound cool but if some girls just want to just it's just respect that it is but I think people are getting confused between what they actually want and what they think they want. Like, what you want changes a lot. Yes. And the reason girls are getting caught out in this, let me chill, and then just getting beat, and now you're crying acidic tears. No, no. It's because... No, yeah, her. Yeah, that's it. That but it's because <laughs> you can only defend in theory. In practical, you can't defend. And that's what killers... Are you saying that girls don't know how to defend? Yes. I was a number nine, innit? I played up top. Like, so what I'm saying is... I'm here to score goals. Like Drogba. So, like Drogba. Joanna. Like Drogba, yeah? Top strikers work out the weakness in the defence, find a chink in the armour, complete mission, move on. Carry on. Bam, move bam, bam. On. It is that simple. It is that simple. And listen, it sounds dumb and it sounds... It, it does sound cynical and it is cynical. So I kind of need you lot to wake up and see that it is a cynical This is game. exactly what Joe Biden said. That clip said... Oh, why did girls let us take their good energy? Why can't they defend themselves better? And I'm like, why should I have to defend myself? Do you know what? I'm not it's because you, you lot are queens. You lot are queens and your princesses... They love to throw the fucking it's queen, the queen shit. Thing. Sorry, they, sorry, my bad. They love to yeah, throw yeah, yeah, yeah. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't piss me off. After these messages, we'll be right back. This way, yeah? We grow up a certain way, boys, okay. yeah? yeah? We grow up, we play with yeah. our Avengers toys, our Batmans, yeah. whatever it is, yeah, yeah? yeah? Girls usually grow up with princesses and babies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you see what I'm saying? Like, my daughter's two and she rolls with her I had baby. A spoon with a dress on. Do you see what I'm saying? Like, as in, like, she, they, already you're built almost in a way that is more for love than yeah. what we are. Our thing is more for war. Yeah, yeah, yeah. and if I'm not off, we want action, man. And yeah, we want, yeah, yeah. like, so your wired, I, I just think over the course of time, you're wired slightly differently. We're so it makes you na naive, but in a good way. Like, it's only not good because we take advantage. And I'm speaking as a man now who doesn't take advantage. But I'm saying I'm talking also as a previous number nine who was scoring <laughs> goals, you, isn't it? it? Yeah, I, mean, I was scoring you know. goals. So what Do you want to apologise to all those women? Not all of them. I not all of them. I understand on the show. 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 I understand on I personally think, you see, like, in theory, so for example, yeah, the chances are a girl, let's call her just Rachel. Joanna, yeah? Okay. 
she will give very good advice to her friend yeah. about what's going on in yeah. her. They'll give very They're good advice because really good in advice. theory, you can defend very well. Yeah. But in practical, you will see a ball that's 30 yards from you and you will try and make that tackle. You will miss the ball and you will get scored past and you will be crying your acidic tears because of it. Like, as in it's not... It's sometimes just 10 yards back and have a look at the pitch. What Facts. do I really want? Am I okay Facts. with this? If this all blows up right now, am I okay with it? Facts, facts. So Facts. it is sometimes like Facts. girls get caught up in the fairy tale world a bit more than guys do. But the pendulum swinging. Yeah. And now it is beginning to get yeah, slightly more balanced. I don't want to have to become a, a nine tackler. Is that what it's called? No. But okay. no, 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 yeah. So I don't <laughs> want... <laughs> yeah, 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 call it that. I don't want to have to become a midfield tackler top nine supreme to be able to win this game. I want to just be able to, like, come with my good intentions, yeah. you come with your good intentions. Now, I'm saying that, and as I'm saying that, I'm realising, you know, fuck it, quote, it's not a fairy tale. And also, you're chatting shit. Here's, the, here's why, yeah? Here's why. I want another guess. You sure. said, yeah? <laughs> you said you had a man. No, wait, what's going on here? What's and, going on here? And he was too vanilla. No, no, wait. That guy was a prick. Okay. He was okay. a prick. Okay. That one was a prick. Now we've added one, that one no, in. No, no, yeah. that one, that one was But a prick. the joke, what I'm saying is, yeah, do you even know what you want right now? Okay, good question. No. Wait, I don't represent all women. I'm actively right now, literally facing my front and being like, do you know what? I'm going to wait till I know what I want. But, so what I'll say then, whilst you don't know what you want, or maybe you Sit know what bench. you want or who you want. Yeah, yeah. Sit on the bench. Substitution bench. Not yeah. every, you, you don't have to play these every games. Every game, yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? So, in gen what I'm saying is, this is whilst, such a good conversation. Like, whilst you are waiting for, yeah. If you want Prince Charming, yeah, yeah. whilst you're waiting for your Prince Charming, yeah. you don't actually have to kiss all these frogs. I don't want the frogs. You know what I'm saying? Frogs. But I understand, I, I, but I do also understand it from a girl's... Frogs are nice to yeah, kiss. Yeah, nice, yeah. Exactly. They usually have exactly. the lingus. Yeah, yeah. The lingus. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm, listen, I saw a tweet, I'll put it up. It said, yeah, that like, toxic guys sometimes have the but listen Energy. don't fall for that baby. toxic because, thing is you know mad. what that is that's a demon yeah that's a demon it's demons it's demon don't time. do it like i feel like when in the future future when you pass away you've lived life to the fullest yeah i feel like you have because you're you're selfish yeah because oh. you wait what, what you said yeah as well because you, you know what you want and yeah. you go through it and you and when the other person doesn't negotiate the right fee that's on them yeah. you don't take that on yeah. yourself now you have beautiful kids and a wife but it's probably She's a whole married, field Oh, sorry. Yeah, yeah you said I'm you were going to get married in seven or 14 years. Did I? Yeah, you did. No, Let's right. go for seven. Seven, yeah. Oh, Let's good. go for seven. That's not good, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> no, but if that's what you lot... Okay, let's move on. Yeah, like, I feel like there's a field out there of women that you have tackled and they've lost legs, yeah. Achilles heels. Yeah, there's debris all over the pitch. They, they didn't get but signed. Like, they are out there still hating you to this day. No, what do you know do why? You do all right, cool. Women? Here's the here's two things. I remember I used to say this here mm -hmm. to a couple of my guys, and with a couple people would agree with me, and a couple would disagree. Mm -hmm. Now, for example, you see when you do the whole thing where you chill with someone that you might like, but mm -hmm. you're just you're not really That's looking true. for anything. Yeah. And then you sleep with him, and he disappears, and you fucks you over, and you cry f for it's whatever reason. Easy, yeah? yeah. It's on you. That is on you. Like, you actually have Rachel. to take that one, yeah? Yeah, yeah, I'm Rachel. Whereas, yeah, if my man spun hella lights yeah. and kind of brought you into this false trash. sense of security, then he's trash. Mm. It's still your L. But it's like, still your L, but you blame him. Yeah, yeah, you, 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 you can get to, blame him. You still get to walk with your chest high. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It doesn't damage you at all. Mm. Do you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Sometimes it's better to be the guy that spins the web, tells the lie, draws the girl in, and lets the girl go, and she hates him for it mm -hmm. because she won't hate herself for it. I hate you. I hate you so much. This guy has managed to let me listen to three minutes of him saying, yeah, that sometimes it's good to fuck over the girl. And I sat here listening. Oh, I can't wait to be a defender. No, but no, 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 no. <laughs> it is. What I'm saying is, sometimes, <laughs> even though... It, I'm going to give you the harsh reality give of it. Give me the harsh reality. Sometimes a guy will talk to a girl as if he's going to wife this girl. Mm -hmm. He knows full well he's not going to wife her. Okay. She also knows full well He's she not going to wife her. She doesn't but know. she's going to listen to the words. Yeah. And they're going to blind her and all of that, yeah? Not just the words. The finger, the touch on the thigh. That, all of that. All yeah, I mean, the touch. The, it's the forehead kiss. That really seals the deal. 
That's the one that get me. Like, yeah, you shouldn't do it. Don't do it, guys. That's wicked, guys. It's the forehead kiss it's that evil. really seals it. I one time I forehead kissed a guy one time and I knew I fucked up the same. I knew I fucked up. <laughs> so it's one of those ones where, like, in in reality, yeah. Uh, read the room. Read the room. All right, cool. Is this really? Is this really? Has okay. this really got legs? Do you know what? Or has it not? Do you know what? I hear you because. You're, what you're doing, even though it pisses me off, you're putting the power back into the woman's hands and saying, yeah. do you know what? This L can be avoidable. All right, cool. I hate you. Let's move on, guys. You guys, enjoy the break. We'll be right back with another segment. I know you're loving it. Do you know what it is? Do you know what it is? Do you know what it is? The harsh reality, yeah? There's so many harsh realities at this point. You see, if a girl... If you have a husband, yeah? And you find out that... You know, after 50 years of marriage, yeah. he's only cheated on you four times. Yeah. You have found an angel. You really? How but you won't give him credit for it. How many times can I cheat? Nah, we don't talk about that. <laughs> <laughs> we don't talk about that. Well, in 50 years, I Nah, you cheat? Nah, 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 we don't do that. We don't do that. We don't do that. We don't do that. We, we get no, 50 yeah. years of the same people. No, we can't have that. We got male ego. You can't do that to Also, us. I can't tell you. you I, I can't, can't tell you. I, yeah, I'm going, <laughs> yeah. Like, nope, yeah, 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 But what I'm saying is, I think over the years, women are... It's drummed into your heads through films, through everything, that men cheat. So you're kind of a bit more numb to it. You almost expect you're ready, it so you're that you're ready to deal with it. Me, if I get cheated on, you will see me crying. <laughs> on Instagram, like... <laughs> That's okay, like, I did that. Is she like... <laughs> it doesn't matter how much cheating I've done. Uh, I will cry. <laughs> I'm not expecting it. It's not saying like, I did I, yeah. If I can, I'm just like, how? How, bro? <laughs> like, I don't deserve this. You know what I mean? Like, like, <laughs> I said, I don't deserve it. Oh, you was caught in the bed, Yo, beautiful people, welcome back to the safe space. This beautiful segment is called This You, and that's when I find something you said, whether visually or verbally, and I just ask, do you still feel the same way? And we flow. I think I'm so scared. Okay, you know what? Can I just say? I said a lot of stuff. Can I say, yeah, I could have gone for the madness. I hear that. But I wanted to go for something a little bit insightful. We've okay. met Savage Dan, but there's so many layers to you. Yeah. So let's play the clip and let's go with it. It's my three loves, yeah, apart from my kids and all, and all of that, yeah. My three loves are football, boxing, and music. That's it. And I always said that I wanted something to do with all three. I, as it stands, I've got something to do with all three. It's crazy. Yeah. Do you see what I'm saying? That's it. And I'll always have so I wanted. I wanted when I was older that was this was gonna be the like the last one. I wanted to own like a, a football team, even if it's just like a lower leagues team. Like literally, like I love Sunday football that much. Yeah. yeah, not even Sunday. Nah, bro. Ooh, I'm starting I'm like rhyme and pro. Like I'm talking like oh. where we have stands, like a stadium. Yeah, 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 like yeah. It, it might cost a couple hundred grand to do, but I want to be able to do that. Do you see what I'm saying? Like and try and like get yeah, this team. Yeah, I want to yeah. play um, football manager, the real life real version. Life. Do you see what I'm saying? That's what I'm trying to do. <laughs> Ultimate team. And man. I want a boxing gym. That's what I'm saying. These are my things. But for now, like I'm involved with Chelsea and doing that stuff. And then I'm involved with JD of boxing. And obviously I'm involved in music just through me. Like I'm here. I'm, I'm knocking on these doors. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like it's sick. all doable. You can stop hey, it. Hey, that was good. I sounded professional, innit? No, did you sound um, professional? You sounded inspirational. Yeah. I listened to that and um, I saw... Look, we just turned from pussy straight over to... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> But I feel do like it both guys. Get someone who can do it both. <laughs> it feels like you have gone through life doing exactly what you love yeah. the whole way through. And um, at one point, I thought, did you do judge? Wait, let me, <laughs> let me land. Let me land. Let me land. Because, bro, I don't understand how you're running from the police. So let's just recap your story real quick. You're running from the police. You break your leg. You decide to then buy some equipment and you learn to mix. It takes you about a year and a bit. Yeah. You then end up getting involved in podcasting and you have the two of the biggest UK podcasts come out of your studio. Yeah. You then go and get a second studio because you saw the listing on the very first day. 
Yeah. All of this while clotting bare chicks before your missus. No, yeah, 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 no, 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 uh, that, honestly, so you do judge? No, <laughs> no. <laughs> I just do. Do you know what it is? Yeah, I am somebody. I would be terrible as an employee. Yeah, I would be terrible as an employee because I would arrive late. I would try and skive off work wherever I could. I'm somebody who's who struggled to even get homework in, and I was very academic, but I was I struggled to get homework in. I don't like doing what I don't like doing. Does that make sense? I, so that makes total sense. The thing is, before I got my I've got an, uh, or I had an extensive criminal record. Mm -hmm. Like, I had this two arms long. Yeah. But before I had that, my idea that I was going to go, <laughs> I was going to go into trading okay. and like um, stop, stop broken and stuff like that. I was probably just chasing money because I have no real interest in it, but I'm quite academic. I went uni, did business and management, all of that kind yeah. of stuff. Um, did you finish uni? In the end, I had to, that story is a bit mad as well. Yeah, 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 yeah. I can do it now because I don't need my degrees. But yeah, I started changing transcripts and like swapping over to different unis. And I had a little mishap with the police, and I had to go to a different uni. And yeah, so basically, I finished it, but I didn't matter. Yeah. Because I also, by the time I finished it, had um, a record that yeah. an employer is going to look at it and say, I don't care about your degree. So it kind of pushed me in a direction where I had to do what I want. For me, it was best that I went and did my own thing. It was a risk. I just had to fund it all myself, do it all myself. You said you were close to going broke when it came to the second studio. Ten? No, no that was the you fourth one. You yeah. had four studios? I've had four, yeah. That's in I've no, had, honestly, yeah. that's incredible. I feel like we're in an era right now where I'm seeing successful businessmen that dress and look like, not necessarily me, but yes. people around me. Yeah. That's mad inspirational. Yeah. Like... The fact that you banter the way you do, the fact that I can relate to you, yeah. but you still are somebody who is... You four studios. Yeah, it's yeah, it's mad. That I, and I almost went broke doing it because I couldn't. I don't even know why I pulled the trigger on it, but I knew it was just such a big opportunity. And it's local. I'm from Grove. It's yeah. in Grove. I had to do it at the time when I did it. Yeah. But I'm a risk taker by nature. Yeah. Like the only place I tried to minimize risk is on a football pitch when I'm I, I play in DM. Like it's an important Defense. position, defensive midfielder. So yeah, me, yeah, me. you was, was close. So close. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was going to say so, like, that's why I, that's the only that's the only position in my life. Yeah, where, where I try to minimize yeah. risk. Yeah, everything else, I'm a risk taker. Like I'll be like, it's an, is it a potential investment? Yeah, is there a fifty percent? This could all go wrong and yeah. blow up. Yeah, but fuck it. Do you know what I'm saying? I, and it, it, like, it pays off. It's been bad times that it hasn't paid off. Tell me about one of those times because I was looking at... Like, I really do think you do judge because I was looking at your... Or, or your, your I'm a man of God. Yeah, okay. Cool. I'm then, a man of that, God. Do you know what? I'm yeah. sorry. That's God. It, yeah. God is all you need, yeah. isn't it? But like, I, look at, I look at your story and I, and I just feel like this is somebody who... Honestly, the odds were against you. You had yeah. a criminal record. You're a black man. Yeah. Like, and yet somehow you've managed to turn that into not one career, but three. Yeah. And and have the respect of so many people as well. Like people respect you. Yeah. Like. But do you know what it is? Honestly, yeah. You see, like a lot of people will get to certain positions in life, yeah, yeah? and will be like, yeah, I did it. I'm the guy. Do you know what I mean, like, rare, 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 whatever it is. Yeah. With me, I'm proper humbled by it. I'm proper humbled by it, and also I'm very aware that it doesn't take much for this the wheels to all fall off it. I'm not going to lie, you got that kind of sauce a little bit and I'm not trying to gash you up. Yeah, I got the sauce. Uh, you got, not, not the sauce, but you got yeah, a got sauce. Some sauce. Okay, yeah, you got some yeah, sauce. Got you some know some what I mean? Sauce. But like, you really have a way of being around people and you spoke about this and you could, you could be put into a mad situation where you know nobody else and you'd be able to fit in. Yeah. I know you're going to be sick of this sport, but it's football no, 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 again. Like it. It's I football like it. again. I, know, I, like I feel it. like football, yeah, football goals. has actually... It can give people ridiculous amounts of... I've, all I've known my whole life is to play football. Mm. From the age of whatever it is, I used to get excited at five years old about playing football yeah. after school. And I still get excited now about playing football on a Saturday. Football has given me so much confidence, probably. So have you gonna been confident give, your whole adult life? I've been, I, my whole life, my that childhood is, life. Like I have it. always felt... I don't think I'm much different now. I'm just an adult version to how I was when I was 10 years old, 15 years old, 20 years old. Most people say, I haven't changed. I'm pretty much the exact same person. What about when you almost went broke trying to open up your next studio? I've almost, almost been broke. I've been broke my whole life. Almost.
bro. You this is what I'm saying. Like, coat. I want to fight this. No, guy. no, like, you, you, you don't get it. All right, cool. Do you know what? Yeah, there was um. I remember the specific week because I remember that was the lowest I'd been for a while yeah. and then the highest I'd been for a while in like five minutes. So yeah. I remember going to play football with my cousin at West West in Labrador Grove and I had literally, I think everything had gone wrong in my life or whatever it was, yeah? I had £1.50 mm. to my name. I live alone. I yeah. have rent to pay. I have all of this stuff, yeah? And I remember saying to him, I bought a Snickers, yeah? And I was like, oh, you know, I've actually got no peace. But I'm not saying it in some kind of, like, crying way. I'm saying it like, bro, I've got no peace. Mm. Like, it's all gone. And then I remember, like, not laughing it off with my cousin, but I'm one of those. You see, like, there are some people that can always find something, find money, whatever it is. I've been, I've probably been given that, like, that kind of gift, that blessing, whatever it is. So by that next week... I had like 15 bags. Hey, hold on, so I missed a step. Sorry, give me a second. So you bought a Snickers and then you got 15k? No, not from the Snickers. Oh, I was really going to... No, 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 no. I was about to go to the no. shop right now. But as in like, no. it, it just, uh, it just like happened. Like as happened, in, yeah. Them days, I think it might have even been poker days, you know. Like I didn't play poker, but I staked my friend who played poker. Okay. And he had just a big week, a mad week where he just, just went mad. Out so I'm saying, so like, I've never, I've, the one thing I've never worried about ever in my life is money because when my back's against the wall, I can find it. Okay. Whether it's a, a, a not so nice way or in a nice way, I will find a way to oh, get yeah. it kind of thing. So it's one of those ones where I've never really worried about money. So when I'm going broke building the studios, it's not even really a new experience for mm. me because I've had to do this not on such a big and professional scale, but yeah. I've had to do this a hundred times before. Can I ask you one more question just for like the people that love clout, yeah? Can you just kind of give your CV of what you've achieved? Like, I, I, know. I, I, know, I know you're not a, I know okay, you're a humble yeah. person, but just, just one time I don't even I know. Space, like, I own... Just, I don't know. I, can, I, I own, remind you. Don't I I own know, studios. So. I own, like, four... How many? Four studios. There's four studios, but they're all in one location now. Whatever, four studios. Studio A, that, yeah. and they're beautiful. Yeah, one they're of them's beautiful, beautiful anyway. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I said one of them. Yeah, yeah. Um, four studios. Um, Something like that I, you work I with, work with your dream team. Yeah, Chelsea, Chelsea that's, a, that's a dream for me, isn't it? I yeah. love Chelsea. Yeah. I've got a show on, the, on, on Chelsea TV. What's the name of the show? It's called Chelsea Unscripted now. Look at that. Look um, at work that. with JD, boxing. Look at that. Um... I don't even you know. Have, you are I've got yeah, I've got yeah, you podcast. Po yeah, I mean, like there's so can many we, things I do. Can you say the podcast that you're part of because these are not this is not half cast, obviously, half cast, everyone will know half cast. Obviously, shout out Chucky, shout out. Um Chloe. obviously so free shot started Come at on, mine, receipt started at mine, all of oh get me like uh, the list goes on and on. Yeah, and then like you it also is. Mixed for artists as well. Oh my know? gosh, I forgot about the whole. This is the main thing. This is my bread and butter, and I forget about it all the time. Because sometimes bread and butter just tastes. Do you know what it is? The yeah. amount of art, I've worked with everyone. It's more a case of who have I not worked who, with. You know, you know what I'm have saying. You with no. All right, then there we go. That's that, probably coming though. It's coming. Yeah, you know that's what probably I mean? coming now that I'm I, in there. I just feel like when people listen to you, they should know that you are authentic, funny, should be in prison, not for crimes, just for crimes against women. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but also you are an incredibly accomplished businessman and a loving father. The whole time when I've yeah. worked with you, I mean, try to get you here and that every time it has been around your kids, it's like I'm yeah. going to school run or whatever. You seem like a very yeah, present for father. Yeah, and I think right. that's amazing. For someone who started off running from the police, it's really worked out for I you. I feel guys. like don't most of us, and no? I thought most of us start off running from the police. No, I never, sir. I never do that. No? <laughs> I never do any of that. Um, all right, cool. Well, that is the end of that segment. You look, get a cup of tea, come back for the very last and most dangerous round. Are you ready? I don't know. Oh, I don't even he's know. Ready, he's ready. Yeah. He's a risk taker. Deviant and them mm. things there. I'll right, see you guys in a bit. Guys, this is what they do in those football ads, right? In those ads, ads. Guys, I don't know. This is not a JD ad. This is an invitation. If you feel like your brand message or product would fit in amazingly in one of these gaps in my show and really speak to my audience, let me know at collabs at coilawow.com. That's collabs at coilawow.com. All right, let's jump straight back in. 
Your beautiful people, welcome back to the final segment of the show with my wonderful guest, Savage Dan. Come on. Snowman Dan, you know what I mean? Safe Space Dan and that. Um, guys, it is the final segment and this segment is called Risk It. It's all in the name. Yeah. It's about to get dangerous. Sounds sounds fine to me. Oh, okay, there you go. Yeah, You've been risking me. it for yeah, a while. Of course, I mean, yeah, my whole life. Kids, yeah. So, do you know what I mean? You, you yeah, exactly. <laughs> Centralised as well, guys. Like, same baby mum. Sorry, girlfriend. Baby, uh, yeah. <laughs> this episode, we're going to be married. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good. All right, cool. So, this, yeah, has not been written by me. This is the only part of the show that I have no control over. Somebody else writes this question. They don't know who you are, um, so it can be a madness. All right, cool. Savage Dan, risk it. You ready? Oh, ready. by the way, you do get one opportunity to say change the conversation. The moment you say change the conversation, <laughs> I have to stop this immediately. But you have to say that now How or now. How big is this? What's going on? I don't know. Well, I'm giving you a chance. I like to give everyone a way out. All right, cool. We're going to move? Yeah. I love my guest, man. All right, cool. Let's jump in. Oh, remember, whatever you do, I have to do. So I have to answer the question too. Okay. All right. Oh, oh, instructions. Okay. Close your eyes. <laughs> Open your mind. <laughs> Who wrote this? Imagine your <laughs> best sexual experience. No names. What made it your best sexual experience? Describe it. Wait, give me a second. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if I was ready either. <laughs> I don't know if I was ready. This guy's having flashbacks. Oh, shit. Do you know what? He's lynching us. It sounds crazy. It does sound crazy. But I'm struggling to pick a one. Okay, that's wow. You've lived life. A lot of pictures. I can only pick one. Is that mad? That's good. <laughs> no names, no dates. Just what made it your best sexual experience? The outrageousness. Describe it. I can't. What? Da Dad. This okay. will come off YouTube, bro. Really? This, yeah, it has it like this. This. Okay, can you give us, can you put us in the ballpark? Because no, do you know what, Dan? I want to learn some stuff today. All right, cool. What made it outrageous? Was it the, the positions you lot were using? Was it the apparatus you involved? Was it where it was happening? Shit, I just got another one. Wait there. Oh, fuck. I'm just done. I'm done. <laughs> I'm done. Welcome to the safe space, guys. It's dangerous for me too. What a life. <laughs> Honestly. Hey, can I just ask one question? What made it mad? Was it where? Was it what was happening? Like, Give us a little bit of insight. It was... How many people were there? Oh, shit. Oh, fuck off. Oh, the... fuck off. Give me a second. Nah. Give me a second. <laughs> <laughs> nah. Dead ass cameras. <laughs> okay. I got it. Um, she came with a bottle of anal lube. Oh. That was just how she came. Oh. What? There was no clothes? What? What do you mean? No, I'm just saying she arrived... She knew what first she wanted date. that day. First date. First date. It's not even a date. Let's not, let's not even jazz it up like that. Let's not even jazz it up like that. It was just... First like... app. First appearance. <laughs> <laughs> what a world, man. I have not joined that club. Honestly, this world is... This world is something else when you go out there and see it. Was it in this country? It was. Okay. Right, I'm still out of this shout world. Shout out you, Ain't No Hannah. Um, all right, cool. <laughs> Um, I don't think mine is as dramatic as yours. When I think of my best sexual experience, it's going to sound so wet now. I just, I remember like, I requested, a, it wasn't a mad move. It wasn't a mad move. I remember you saying that you feel like mission, missionary is one of the best positions. 100%. Like, so I, like, obviously, I just, this person was, um, sw I feel like this person, do you know what, fuck it, I'm going to talk, I'm going to talk English. Yeah, talk, talk, I'm going to talk, talk, English. talk, talk. This person, um, was well gifted and like do you know what i mean we did our thing wherever um and i was like do you know what i would like to to, to venture because you know missionary is dangerous because that's how you ca you can start feeling feelings where there was no feelings do you know what i mean so missionary is dangerous and i said can i get a double helping of that please um and yeah i just remember do you know also i felt so comfortable yeah. I know that sounds mad, Jeff. You fell in love. She fell in love. I didn't fall in love. She I didn't love. fall in love. What? Yeah, yeah, I didn't she did fall it. in love. You did it. I did. <laughs> and number nine. And I, number nine. I didn't fall in love at all. I didn't fall in love, but I did block him. Like, no, wait, hold on, I'm joking. I'm following him, though. But I'm joking. Um, I 
definitely enjoyed it. I just felt really comfortable. Like, I don't think I'd felt... I, I hadn't enjoyed yeah. sex yeah. before that, I feel like. That, like, I genuinely thought sex was for the other person, which is so naive and whatever, but the truth is I genuinely thought sex was something I do for the guy when I... Whoa! Like, we think it's something we do for you. Barely. That's what I think. Yeah, well, shout out to you. Yeah, shout out for me, but I think it's for you. Shout out to you. No, not my... No, not but, my... Yeah. Mm -mm. But so, him... But but him he like I felt I felt pleased that like, my, my body re, like reacted and responded and I and I felt very present and um <laughs> I love all the words. <laughs> and, and, I, I, <laughs> and I no I enjoyed it. I genuinely enjoyed it and it let me know that wow sex is actually mad enjoyable. Like yeah. mad enjoyable. So um yeah, that was that was that was it wasn't all the stuff he didn't come. No, nah, no, nah, yeah, my, yeah, my, yeah, my thing's all thing mad, yeah, thing my thing's all, yeah, my thing's all mad. Nah, maybe in a couple of years. You know what? I'm, I'm quite open. Mm, probably not say I'm open. Alright, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, guys, yo, that's the end of the. Oh, that's no, the no, 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 yeah, yeah. I'm oh, sorry, I was just there, trying is to there see. Another thing? No, I've, there's a lot of things, but wow. Another time, another show. No, no, same show, same show. Season two, <laughs> season two, and them things there. Yo, Savage Dan. Snowman Dan, Safe Space Dan, thank you so much for thank coming Thank you for on. having me. This has been such an... Did you enjoy yourself? I did, of course I did. Did you? Because, you I know, did. he said he had to leave at like 8.30 or something. We passed that time now, so thank you. What's on a set? Thank you so much. I'm glad you enjoyed yourself. I had an amazing time. Um, and guys, that has been the Safe Space. Make sure you tune in next week for another episode. Boom! <laughs>